It is never too early to show up for race day. NASCAR fans are hunkering down outside Charlotte Motor Speedway for Sunday's Coca-Cola 600. Queen City News reporter Daniel Pierce had a chance to sit down with some to hear why they made this race a family tradition. Motor racing is a sport that has captivated the globe. The birthplace of NASCAR being right here in our sliver of the Carolinas, which is why Charlotte Motor Speedway is unlike any racetrack in the world. You come to Charlotte Motor Speedway to feel the heat from the tires, the sounds of engines revving. Before the excitement of race day, there's a different noise echoing outside the Coca-Cola 600. Boom. The sound of race fans bonding. You know, you just meet a lot of people that, you know, you, you really have a lot in common with. God, you're good. For Greenville, South Carolina native Darlene Farron, you're not a true race fan unless you arrive a few days before the actual event to wait in a line of RVs to camp out. And we still come up every year. We still put up our tents. We put all the pegs in. And wake up to this view every morning. Still come back every year. Why? All of us do. Why do you do it? Like, why? It's just racing. It's just racing. It's fun. In no better spot than Charlotte Motor Speedway, where the sport has a connection to the birthplace of NASCAR. The fans you meet here, well, are a class of their own. This is the center of racing right here. It's interacting with the fans. People care, uh, have, uh, carry a common passion, common thread. Drivers take a shot at winning the longest NASCAR race there is. But regardless of who ends up in the winner's circle, these fans say they've already won. We're not here to watch the crashes and that sort of thing. We're, we'd just like to see good, clean hard racing. The Xfinity truck race happening on Friday, the bet MGM race happening on Saturday, that title race happening at Charlotte Motor Speedway on Sunday. Outside Charlotte Motor Speedway, Daniel Pierce, Queen City News.